Welcome back to Dilly Squat Gaming. Today we are in Farming Simulator and we are we have a big task ahead of us. We've got basically windrow all this grass turn it into bales and then try to sell it because well we frankly don't need we have we have pretty much a, as much hay as we need. So uh, I don't think we're anywhere near a good price for hay. In fact, where are we here? Uh, hay is going to be do, do, do right there. It's 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 pretty much at its worst right now. <laughs> it's 95 and it's going down to 90. So yeah, it's May. It's spring. It's yeah, it's going to take a while. So um, even though we're getting bad price, tell you the truth, the max is 110. So it's only a 20% uh, difference. It's not that bad. We need money. We're we're down to $11,000. We have a trailer. That I may end up trading in for an auto stacker just because um, I would I would love to be able to try to uh, speed up the process of this whole series right now. I know it's slow. Just bear with me. It's going to be a fight to to basically get us to the point where we're uh, doing some good farming and uh, yeah. I don't I don't plan on going anywhere, so I hope you guys don't either. Um, and there's not really a whole much more I can say except for that. Uh, yeah, this is the way it, it turns out when you. Uh, when you do uh, a series like this where you're you're starting off with basically nothing, um, you have a very limited amount of money. And you just got to you got to make things do so. And, and you know what? Tell you the truth, that's the way the real world is. Uh, so this is probably the most realistic farming series that I've ever done. Or I've been a part of. Or I've seen. Uh, no, I'm not 100% sure if that's true or not. But uh, anyways, I, I really, 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 really want to get a bigger Wind Rover. I think that would speed things up quite a bit. Um, in fact, you know what? How how much will it speed things up? We've got oh we've got thirty two sheep now, so that's that's standard. I think I think we've always had thirty two sheep. Uh but anyways, let's yeah there we go. Let's go into the store. Let's see here. Uh, wind rowers, they're gonna be down here somewhere. I can I can never find them when I need them. Um, this is the one we have, which is lousy 3.8 meters wide or 3.4 meters wide. This is kind of the same deal. Single. Yeah. Uh, we really got to get up to this guy before we get 8.4. This is at least a dual. It would be less than a thousand dollars to lease it. Okay, I just, I made up my mind just like that. Should I have, uh... Maybe I should have checked for, like, this one. Nope. All these are pretty heavy. And they're high horsepower, so I think we're good on horsepower. So, yeah, let's fold this up. We're gonna go sell this. We're going to speed things up quite a bit. And this is this is really where the series should start shining. I hope. <laughs> the the downside is right now is I'm I'm on my way over there and I have no clue if this trailer can pull it or not. But we will find out. I I think it can. I don't see why it couldn't. Um, I'm pretty sure we are over eighty. Where are we? 
it would help if I was in the right menu. Ooh, that looks like fun. This little thing is a uh, nice little logging. Anyways, ah, uh, that would be good too to have. Darn, I wish we had the money for that. That's a that's an amazing deal. Uh, anyways, uh, small tractors. We've got our little tiny electric tractor. It's sixty-eight horsepower. Uh, we need eighty. I hope. I hope. If if that's the case and we can't pull it or use it, uh, you guys will not see any of this because I will edit this out as if I already knew. Oh, a little. <laughs> Got a little sketchy there. We can actually zoom in a little bit more. And it's always the opposite side of the road that I think. So I'm going to drive on this side of the road. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, I, th I think getting this windrower is going to make a huge difference. And then the next upgrade... Ooh, I forgot there's gates. Nope. Open. There we go. Does it open in? No, it opens. Yeah, it opens in. Perfect. Alright, first things first. Let's go ahead and we'll drop this off. Um, nope, wrong game. This is silly of me. Look at the size of this thing. <laughs> oh, I hope we have enough power to move. Alright, let's unfold it. Let's lower it. We do not have access to this land, but... We are pulling it at 9 miles an hour, so we are good. Let's actually go ahead and detach it. And we will get this sold. This was a, uh... Well, I wouldn't say it was a waste of money, but you know what? It was a good first... First tool. Um, so I think we have to be here. Yeah, so let's, uh... Let's repair it. Let's repaint it for 550 bucks. Ugh. You know what? We get a little money out of it, so... And, uh, let's sell it. Look at that, so... We actually ended up with more money. <laughs> but unfortunately, we do not own a windrower now. We are renting this one. So... We, uh, yeah, we need to, uh, we probably should have bought this first. Or rented it first. And then we could have done both fields. And then at least would have felt like we uh, got a bargain out of it, but...
Okay, we are going to finish up the little corners in this uh, this little circle of mine, <laughs> and oh, what did I do? Nope. Yeah, I knew I put it on a worker. No, get off the worker. There we go. Okay. I don't know why I kept putting it on a worker, because I was hitting the correct buttons. Crazy game. Anyways. Let's uh, get this all straightened up. And yeah, this uh, this made a huge difference. Like, we would have been here, I think, four times as long? I, I'm going to guess it's at least four times faster. If not more. It, it may even be more. It's hard to believe that it would be more. But, like, you're only double the width. But I just, I think it's the lack of driving time. And, yeah, it's just somehow it makes it at least four so I don't even care about the little patches that I'm gonna miss I may actually come back and and get those lifted up there's they're small so it's not a huge deal I mean you're talking about one maybe two bales let's see and then this one And kind of just drop it in, shoot down the middle, and call that good. Now, by by no means am I going to uh, return this yet because it's it's just too valuable. Uh, you know what? I am gonna I'm gonna roll that up pretty pretty tight. I think this is the only downside with the uh, going in circles. Although going in circles is way faster. I don't care who says other. <laughs> to, to me, it is way faster. So uh, I guess we got that little corner here. We'll hit that up real quick. This shouldn't be too long at all. Uh, too soon. Okay, you know what? It's, it's one big pile now, so let's uh, let's jump over to the top part. Whoa, <laughs> we're actually jumping the windrows. That's that's amazing. All right, and we will do this real quick because this is kind of ugly up here. So let's get this all cleaned up. I still don't want to return it yet. I think this is all we have. We'll double check our other field to see if it's mo mobile. Mobile? Yeah, if we can mow it. <laughs> and if we can't, then we will go ahead and return this. If we can, maybe we'll do a quick mow on it. And, and gather up more. I, this is all I want to do now is play with hay. And grass. This is it. Nothing else. This is all you guys are going to see from now on. It's just me driving around with this thing on an electric tractor that is slightly underpowered, but it still works, which I'm really, I'm really glad it is. Um, this probably will be my next purchase. I'll, I'll rent it once. And then, um, yeah, we'll own it. Because we are we are going to be using this a lot, and I don't know if I want to do. I want to go into silage. Like silage is a lot cheaper. Or er, sorry, scratch that. It's a lot more. Um, you get a lot more money when you sell silage, but you do have to buy the bale wrapper. Where with the silage. Or with the uh, the hay, you just have to, uh, well, basically rake it up and um, 
bail it up and you're done. So there's that extra step in there. And that will, uh, that extra step does cost you a, a fair penny. So, um, one day we'll, we'll do silage because we'll need it. The cows will need it. Uh, but for now the sheep don't. So, all right. I think, uh, we'll fold that up. And we will take this back to the yard. And we will grab the uh, the baler. Now we are about halfway through on the battery of, of this thing, so that may come into consideration in a little bit. But for now, I guess we'll just leave that here. We still only have that little pallet of 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 wool, so that's not doing any, us really any good. Um, that's the picker upper. Where's my bale? Uh, there's some extra bales for winter. Where is my baler? Did I leave it out in the field? Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. This is trying to go through too fast. Um, did I overlook it? <laughs> I think I did. All right, well, let's uh, slam on the brakes. We'll jump out. We'll open this up. It's not back here, is it? No. Oh, there it is. I knew it was here somewhere. Oh, yeah, this is uh, this is the next thing I want to upgrade. Uh, but the issue is, is we have to upgrade the tractor. Uh, we're really only using the equipment that it can handle. It can't really handle much more because unfortunately they need horsepower. And so the question is, is do, which one do we get first? <laughs> the tractor or one of these things. So I'm going to start here. This is going to start, this is going to poop them out pretty quick. Turn it on. Don't think we have to lower the header, do we? No. Um, so yeah, this is, this is creating bales at an exponential rate. <laughs> Ah, uh, you know what? Um, if I go F1. Okay, we got seven bales. I, I believe that's been reset. Let's actually leave it open and see how fast it goes up. Yeah, it's going up pretty quick. Alright, I think, uh, yeah, I think we're ready for uh, another time lapse. And uh, in the comments, why don't you take a guess? How many bales are we going to end up with? Look at the line of bales. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, take a wild guess and I will I will hide that so that nobody knows. And uh, I'm going to guess it's going to be 300. I'm going to say 300 plus. Uh, but yeah, you let me know in the comments how many bales you think we're going to get out of here. And uh, yeah, I'll uh, I'll let you know in the uh, next episode.
right, so we just have this little section left. So, um, I'm gonna, I, I wanna redo my guess. <laughs> Um, I'm going to say we're closer to 500 fails. And I know that sounds ridiculous, but I truly think we are. And I, I haven't even tried to get every little piece of, of grass out here. Just because I know that is going to be a lot of bales. A lot of bales. So um, I don't I don't really need more than this so can't wait till we get bigger equipment where we can collect you know a higher percentage of bales or I guess a higher percentage of grass itself or hay I should say um, but yeah it's uh, it's it's going pretty quick um, I'm actually kind of shocked just just the windrower just being able to go around windrowing and getting bigger rows of, of hay that we can then bale up. Um, what's going to end up taking forever is I think the uh, the baling of all these or, or the collecting of them all with the uh, the auto loader. So I think I, I definitely think I'm going to sell the trailer that I have and get the auto loading trailer um, because just trying to get all this to the sell point is going to be uh, it's going to be very time consuming so and I, I don't really want to bore you guys with it too much but um, yeah I guess if I guess if push comes to shove you guys can um, you can always fast forward that part I guess but I, I'm going to try to make it as entertaining as possible um, so yeah we are on our last little row uh, I do want to go up along the fence because it looks like I, uh, I do have a good amount of hay there, so. You know, I've got these little sections here. I've got this whole section here that I could probably go over two or three times before I get it all. And I suppose I probably should have just windrowed all this up. But it's, you know, it's probably really not worth it. The amount that I have right now is just astronomically high. Just gotta make sure I'm using the right words. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to pick up this one little row here. And then I'm going to pause it. I'm going to stop recording and I'm, I'm going to look at how much hay we have. Uh, so let's try to get, yeah, let's get this one last chunk. Perfect. Um, oops, didn't want to do that. Let's unload the hay. And that one doesn't want to fall off. Come on, fall off. There you go. Okay, let's fold this up. That That's, uh, uh, yeah, this thing folds up really small. And uh, yeah, I'm going to stop recording here real quick. All right, well, I know exactly how much hay we have or how many bales we have. Uh, I was definitely off with my first guess. So let's just put it that way. So um, yeah, let's go put this back. We will grab the uh, the baler. And yeah, we're going to see we're going to see what we what we're going to end up with cuz yeah i got i got to figure out how we're going to do this cuz i don't want it to take decades <laughs> to do so uh it is technically whoa 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 it is technically 2:30 in the afternoon um so we should probably get Should probably get the uh, windrower back to the store before we have to pay for it. Uh, yeah, this field is definitely not ready to be cut. Nope, still growing.
Where are we? we? We're about, what, one third of the way through our battery? So surprisingly, this tractor does have a long battery life to it. I'm, I'm kind of shocked. I expected it not to, uh, not to almost last two full days. Oops. I fell out of the tractor. Oh, I can't even open that up yet. I completely forgot. Um, yeah. I'm just, I'm doing the math of how many bales we have right now and how this only holds 14. We are... Yeah, we are going to be here for a while. Even just to drive around... <laughs> and pick these up. Go ahead and back. Uh, I hate these ones that, uh, give you the trouble. We'll just jump over everything. <laughs> if I could drive in a straight line, that would probably help out a lot. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so we've got... Technically three more. And then, uh, one more. Alright, so that's our one. <laughs> our one bail wrapped. Um, I guess we will just go ahead and un unload them in the fields. Yeah. Um, I'm going to pause here for a second. And I want to go see... I want to go see what the other... Uh, Baylor will do. Because I don't even remember. I think these are 125s. Uh, so let's take... Let's take this back to the farm store and we will go finally pick up our trailer and we will see, we'll see what it can do. I feel like we should be able to throw on like a thousand bales onto <laughs> one trailer. Now the, the biggest issue that I'm probably going to have is pulling it with such a small tractor. That's probably going to be very, very heavy. Hmm. Yeah. All right. I will see you at the store. Okay. So it appears that there is some type of glitch going on. Um, I can return this. Okay. Perfect. Oops. I can. I can still go in here and find my tether and I can sell that. I, I did I not sell? No, I sold the tether. Shoot. I know what I did wrong. Whoopsie. <laughs> I screwed up. Uh, you know what? That's okay. Let's see what we have for tethers. I don't know why I was thinking the wind roller. Yeah, the wind roller. Yeah. Shoot. Well, you know what? I think when we, um, when we go to lease, we will lease that one again. We'll, we'll, we'll just list, lease these things for now. <laughs> Uh, now the important thing is I want to go to bail loaders. 
And that's 19.5. So let's go ahead and. Yeah, let's go ahead and get that auto loading baler. Auto loading trailer. Sorry, not baler. Um, yeah, we're going to just keep it. For a hundred bucks, I'll pay for work lights. Why not? Where are the beacons? Ah, eh, whatever. And license plates. We're going to go none. Oops, no plate. Perfect. And yeah, we're going to buy this. We are now flat broke. We're going to go into the ones that we owe. So we are going to sell this one. So we're, yeah, we're down a little bit, uh, but that's okay. That, that is exactly what it is. So, uh, where's our trailer or where's our tractor? That's, that's what I meant to say. All right. And, uh, yeah, so. That is, uh, this is how we're going to do it. Oh my God. I'm already on the wrong side of the road. Yeah. You can honk at yourself. Jeez. Give me a break here. The whole driving on the left hand side of the road is weird. All right, yeah, we'll see you at the farm. All right, well, let's see how well this does. I doubt it will pick up our big bale of bales. Um, so if I, yep. How many bales will this hold? Oh, will it pick up that giant bale? I think it will. This guy's is, uh, this is way better. Way better. And I hate to say it, but I may end up just selling. <laughs> I may end up just selling the, uh, the bale, the auto baler that we have. Um, tell me this goes like three or four high. Look at all this hay. Oh, this is amazing. I probably should just stick to the outside and work my way in. I honestly can't believe how much bales we have. And I know the true number. I know the final number that we have. So I will let you guys know in the next episode what that turned out to be. How high are we going to be able to go on this thing? Normally you go three high with the bigger bales. But these are tiny bales. Oh. And it really is starting to show the weight. I, I bet you we go six high. That's my guess. Right now we're three high. Oh, we're going four high for sure. And then this should error. Yep. So it looks like it will pick that thing up. Uh, which is kind of cool. Okay, are we going to go 5-5? Five, five? Yes, we are going 5-5. Five, five. Uh, 
Uh, let's grab these ones first. I'm going to end up forgetting them. Which isn't the end of the world. But let's grab them now. Is it gonna go six? Um, wow. Okay, was I right? Is it gonna go six high and then end there? If you guys can do the math, you can probably guess how many I have. So I will, I think I will probably end this episode before I'm able to pick up everything. Kind of fun trying to dodge all of the uh, the bales. Oh, it's going seven high. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. There's no way it's going eight. We're just, we're running over bales. Um, I'm just shocked at how high this is going. Is this going to go eight? If it goes eight, I'm quitting. Okay, we are full. Uh, so we have five wide. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. By seven high. That is, that is pretty impressive. Um, so if you do the math, you could probably get a rough idea of how many bales we have, but, uh, yeah, my, my guess is, is that thing's going to go bye-bye. Um, I'll call it an episode. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and, uh, give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't, and we will see you in the next one. Bye for now.